the more data we have, the more cats that are signed up, um, the more things we can find. Uh, everybody's always asking me, so how many cats do you want? And I'm like, well, honestly, I'd love to have all of them. Probably not going to happen anytime soon, but, but genetics is, you know, especially for traits that have an environmental and a genetic component, it can get really hard to untangle those two things and actually right. find the genetic changes that influence the traits. And so the more cats that are enrolled and the more that we know about them, the more power we have to do that science. And this really is a, a long-term sort of project. This isn't something that's going to wrap up in a year. We're trying to build a data resource that will help you know, whether it's my group or all the other people out there that are interested in studying cats, it's actually going to keep cat science moving forward for a long time to come. I'm so excited for this project. And and for our listeners, the code, if you want to get involved and you want to send in your cat's fur, the code for that uh, $50 price is his and. So it's the and is the ampersand. So it's his ampersand tell 25. And then you can just go to darwinsarc.org and get started. <laughs> 